Hello again. Today we're going to be talking about something, a strategy that good readers do. Now good readers, whenever we're reading books, will oftentimes ask ourselves, I wonder questions while we're reading. So that means that as we read, we're asking ourselves questions and we're looking to see if we can read on or look at the pictures to find the answers. Now the book that we're going to be looking at today is Olivia Forms a Band. Now, if you've not read this book, I highly recommend it. Olivia is very, very funny. Olivia the pig here. And you can find this book at your local library. Let's take a look at Olivia Forms a Band by Ian Falconer. And we're gonna be trying to think of questions. I wonder questions as we go. Olivia couldn't find her other red sock. What's the matter? asked her mother. I can't find my other red sock, said Olivia. What are all those all over the floor? They don't go with this one. Okay, Olivia's pretty funny. So I wonder why, so one question I have is I wonder why she thinks that all of these red socks are different. I wonder. I found it. <laughs> Looks the same to me. Olivia's mother was packing a picnic. I want everyone everyone ready by seven for the fireworks, she said. And the band, cried Olivia. Oh, I don't think there will be a band, said her mother. But you can't have fireworks without a band, explained Olivia. I know, we'll be the band. Oh, doesn't look like every, anyone else is too happy with that idea. I wonder why they don't like that idea. Goes back to reading his paper. Hmm, I wonder. Fine, said Olivia. I'll be the band. What kind of band are you thinking of? Asked her mother. A fireworks band, of course. Okay. So that was a good question of what kind of band was she thinking of? Look at what her mother's thinking of versus what Olivia was thinking of. But sweetheart, one person can't be a whole band, said Olivia's mother. Why not? Because the word band means more than one person, and a band sounds like more than one person. I wonder how Olivia thinks that she's going to be an entire band. That's another one of my I wonder questions. I'll read on. But this morning you, sound, you told me that I sounded like five people. <laughs> okay, that just answered my question. I think, so she thinks she's so loud that she's going to be an entire band by herself. So all day long, Olivia gathered everything she needed to make her band. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's she doing? Oh, dear. Look, Daddy, we're twins. <laughs> Finally, she was finished. All that was left was to choose the perfect outfit. Ping, tinkle, tinkle, cling, strum, clang, ting, 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 thump, ting, thump, bang, bang, whap. I wonder what could be making all of that noise. Oh, that's what's making all of that noise. And when she marched in, everyone agreed that Olivia did sound like more than one person. Whistle, bang, bang, bong, bong, boom, whistle, clang, ting, 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 clang, boom, dong, dong, ding. Okay. So, as you can tell, as so good readers, what we do is as we read, we're pausing and we're asking I wonder questions, and then we're reading on to see if we can find the answers. So now, um, I encourage you, if you have not read this book, to go ahead and finish it after you find it in your library. But I also encourage you that as the books that you are reading uh, this time around, go ahead and ask yourself some I wonder questions as you read. Happy reading.